sometimes when there's like a lot of like uh, health issues and stuff like that, it could be because there's still iniquity and things that need to be cleansed. And so what happens is both the, the soul and the flesh and technically the spirit can be defiled to a degree. Okay. Because remember, it's like a temple and it's also different rooms, mansions in the spirit, in the soul. And what, that's why we talk about the territories. The territories are basically uh, exactly like that. Your soul is a realm. And because there's different territory, you could be good in one area of your life, but in one area, you keep on going back to the alcohol or keep on going back to the lust or the pornography or whatever it is. Okay. Think about like the promised land, the, the Philistines or the Canaanites, etc. the Nephilim, they occupied certain realms, certain regions, but yo, the Israelites had to go and take that land. And eventually they, be, they got, they became ensnared because they didn't wipe out all of the, the, the Nephilim. And so then what happens is through all of the pagan practices, uh, Baal worship, Molech and stuff, Ashua poles, they started doing all, getting into all of this sin. And then eventually it became deep perversion and iniquity to the point where it's be, now being passed down generationally. It can be passed down in the spiritual DNA book um, where I talk about the, the crown gate, the heart gate, the occipital gate, the thalamus gate, which is all of these facets of the, the creation of God for the human spirit to connect with the spiritual realm. So remember, the Holy Spirit comes, fills that inner sanctuary, which is our spirit. Then the soul is the inner